One of the most important things you can do for your website is to create a sitemap. A sitemap basically indexes your website, all the pages, as well as all the links. It's very search engine friendly. There's a few different types of sitemaps that we're going to show you how to create. Okay, you've heard me refer to sitemaps a couple of times, and I'm going to show you how to build one. But basically what a sitemap does is it indexes your website, every page, every link, and makes it much more user-friendly for the search engines to crawl, spider, or index. This is one of the free sitemap generators that you can use, sitemapdoc.com. You can also just type in a search parameter for sitemap generator and many will come up. With this one, the maximum entries, as many of the free ones are, is 500 pages. And we're just going to type in Annapolis Canoe and Kayak. And we're going to create a map. And here it's indexed all the pages for us. It's told us if we have a problem with one, this one doesn't have a description, so we can go back in and either change it, delete it, or modify it however we need. In this case, we're just going to go up here and we have our options to create a Google sitemap, an HTML sitemap, a text sitemap, an RSS feed. What we're going to start off with here is a Google sitemap and that quick and this is the index okay now we've generated a sitemap so we're going to go ahead and click in the text and we're going to highlight the text that's been generated we're going to right click it we're going to copy it and then we're either going to go to notepad or in this case in Dreamweaver I created a blank document and I'm going to paste it right in the body of an HTML document and then we're going to do a file save as and as we see here we're going to call it sitemap.xml and then we're going to save it in the root file of our website And here we've located our sitemap we just created and we put inside our root file. And we're going to go ahead and upload that to our server. And that's the first step. Okay, now we're going to set up a Google sitemap. 